Hi, I've been experiencing this burning sensation in my eyes. Feels really itchy and scratchy for the past two weeks. Hi, I'm Luna, the pharmacist. I'm really sorry to hear you're going through this eye discomfort. Let's get you settled in our private counseling area so we can go over everything and find some relief for you. Thank you so much. Can I get your name and age, please? Sure. My name is Michael Thompson, and I'm 30 years old. Nice to meet you, Michael. Can you tell me a bit more about what you're experiencing? Yeah, it's this constant burning and itchiness in both eyes, like something's irritating them all the time. Almost like there's sand in there, but I can't find anything when I check. I'm a software developer, so I'm glued to my computer screen all day, and I've noticed difficulty in moving the lids. Sometimes my eyes look red, and it gets worse at the end of the day. On windy days, they start tearing up too. The discomfort comes and goes, but it feels like it's happening more often now. I can imagine how frustrating that must be. Have you talked to your doctor about this? No, I haven't yet. Okay. Have you tried anything to help with the symptoms? Nope. Nothing at all. All right. To give you the best recommendations, would you mind if I ask you some questions about your medical history and lifestyle? Sure. Go ahead. Thanks. First off, is there any pain in your eyes? No. No pain at all. Good to hear. Do you have any vision problems? No, nope, my vision's fine. All right. Are your eyes feel more sensitive to light lately? No, not really. Have you noticed any unusual discharge? No discharge. Have you experienced any blunt trauma or accidents involving your eyes? No, nothing like that. How about exposure to chemicals or heat like welding? No, I haven't been exposed to anything like that. Is there anything foreign in your eyes? Just that sandy feeling. Do you wear contact lenses? No, I don't. Okay. Do you have any medical conditions? No, I'm pretty healthy overall. Great. Are you on any prescription medications? No. How about non-prescription medications? Nope, none at all. Do you take any herbals or supplements? I don't take any of these. Do you have any allergies? No allergies. Do you smoke? Yes, I do. And what about alcohol? Just occasionally. And how is your diet? It's pretty normal. Nothing special. Thanks for sharing all that. Based on what you're describing, it sounds like you might be dealing with dry eyes, which is pretty common, especially when spending a lot of time on screens. I recommend trying some lubricant eye drops, like Sustain. It can ease your dry eye symptoms. Apply one to two drops. Of the eye drops in each eye, three to four times a day. If you need to use the lubricant eye drops for more than four times a day, it's advisable to use a preservative-free product to prevent any negative effects. Okay, that sounds good. If your symptoms don't improve in three to five days or get worse, you should definitely see a healthcare practitioner. Okay, I will watch out for that. Here's how to apply the eye drops properly. First, wash your hands. Tilt your head back and look up. Then pull down your lower eyelid to create a small pocket. Hold the dropper above your eye without touching it and squeeze gently to let the drops fall into the pocket. Close your eyes gently for about a minute. Don't blink or rub them. You can also press your finger gently on the inner corner of your eye for one to two minutes to keep the drops from draining out. And don't forget to wash your hands again. Got it. That seems easy enough. If you notice any stinging or irritation, it might be a sign of preservative toxicity. If that happens, you may need a different product or a preservative-free option, and it might be worth a referral for further assessment. That sounds manageable. Great. Also, here are some non-drug measures you can try. Avoid smoking or smoky rooms. Steer clear of air drafts like ceiling fans. Use humidifiers. Wear sunglasses outside or even moisture chamber glasses. Cool, moist compresses can provide temporary relief too. Staying hydrated and getting enough sleep is also key. Also, it is good to add some omega-3 rich food can help, like salmon and nuts. I'll definitely try those out. Just a heads up. It's common to blink less frequently when you're focused on screens, like when reading or gaming. Try taking regular breaks. Lower your computer screen below eye level and make a conscious effort to blink more often. Thank you for all this information. Of course. How about we give you a call in two to three days to see how you're doing? Yeah, that sounds great.